Hello again. Alright, seriously, I hope the next update I give y'all doesn't have me walking up and down the road to or from an auto shop. But, uh... Yeah, I was just sitting at the house. Off day. Shop's closed, no managers to run the store. And... I'm just sitting there and my phone goes, ba -ding! but not like the, hey, you got a phone call, ba -ding! or hey, someone's trying to talk to you, ba -ding! or hey, you got a text message, ba -ding! but no, it's the, hey, someone just sent you a voicemail, ba -ding! so I'm like, all right, what's this? Oh, hey, it's the mechanic. Yeah, he's got my truck ready to pick up. Uh, super. I don't remember getting a phone call from him with the price of repairs or the estimate what it would cost so I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna have fun walking down there and finding out the, the damage to my bank account now that my truck's already finished with the repairs but nope just uh there's that okay here's my face hello how you doing outdoor research sun hat because it's sunny out and uh i don't think it's gonna rain today so let's let's hope anyways uh yeah put up my video last week and uh, uh, a big a big thank you to to everyone that stayed subscribed the the few years i didn't upload and I hope y'all enjoy this next adventure with me as much as I'll enjoy bringing y'all with me. So, uh, great, great for y'all to, to come along. I got a uh, response from uh, <laughs> Mr. Jimmy. Oh, Miss Jimmy and I believe they helped me out on the AT 2017 numerous times. First was the day I climbed out of the NOC. And they had some good down south home cooked gumbo for me. Gumbo and rice and sodas and oranges and just everything I needed. They gave me a, a ride into Fontana Village to help track down a, a package slash letter someone sent me <laughs> and uh they were they're just really great people great people great people well anyways mr jimmy saw that i just put up a video and he's like hey red mage i'm down here in louisiana in baton rouge which is about i don't know 50 miles that way and he says uh he's down here oh uh, seeing it seeing his mom 99 years old and going strong and he, he asked if he'd uh if he could take me out to, to lunch i said it'd be great to catch up with you mr jimmy boy let me tell you this i'll i'll throw a picture of the restaurant we went down to to go check out in, in man shack Little local place called Middendorf's. But he he was just a boy when I tell you a breath of fresh air, it was uh great to hear from him. All the encouragement that he was giving me from uh testimonies he had heard of other people that had hiked the Appalachian Trail, comparing it to the Pacific Crest Trail, how the AT was physically more demanding, so as long as I could take care of the physical needs, the Pacific Crest Trail was nothing but a 2,650 mile walk. <laughs> so, and, and I expressed some concerns I had with them about the weather and the desert and the elevations, but that'll all, that'll all just, it, 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 what will happen will happen what will be will be but it was it was great to to catch up with mr jimmy again and 
they they live up in Tennessee so it was a it was a it was a rare 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 chance that my uploading of a video correspond with him being down here in Louisiana so that was that was great almost there We're almost there ah I didn't check the weather other than look up at the sky and see that it's probably not gonna rain but let me tell you it's hot hot down here in the south Look at that. I'm sweating more than a long-tailed cat in a room full of rocking chairs I guess uh, heavy denim jeans and a, a black work shirt probably wasn't the best attire to wear while uh, March hiking a, a couple miles up a uh, uh, blacktop highway but it's only a couple miles and I can see where I'm going it's just right there right there -ish, right there yeah uh, but yeah no uh whew. and I for some reason didn't eat any breakfast or drink anything this morning before uh, leaving the house so I'll probably do it I'll drive through McDonald's and feel ashamed of myself. 